Another year has gone by. The cat has decided to come back to the exact spot where she met the husky for the first time. And surprisingly saw the husky from afar. She was glad seeing her long-lost friend. But he was not alone. He did not see her, so she decided to just watch them from a distance. After that event, Alex the cat has refrained from visiting the park. Yet, the truth was, Clementine also saw Alex that day. He saw her leaving the park. There is one famous story you probably know. The Little Prince by Antoine de Saint Exupéry. Introduced to me by a very, very good friend. One chapter of the story is about the friendship of the Little Prince and the fox. There was a part where the little prince asked how he can tame it, and this is what the fox said. You must be very patient, replied the fox. First, you will sit down at a little distance from me, like that in the grass. I shall look at you out of the corner of my eye, and you will say nothing. Words are the source of misunderstandings. But you will sit closer to me every day. The next day, the little prince came back. It would have been better to come back at the same hour, said the fox. If, for example, you come at four o'clock in the afternoon, Then, at three o'clock, I shall begin to be happy. I shall feel happier and happier as the hour advances. At four o'clock, I shall already be worrying and jumping about. I shall show you how happy I am. But if you come at just any time, I shall never know at what hour my heart is to be ready to greet you.
one must observe the proper rights and code. Maybe Clementine was patient. Maybe he paid attention. But maybe he wasn't consistent enough. Or maybe Clementine was not rather on time. Friendships are of many kinds. I suppose most of them are out of familiarity and connections and do not last long. Some are unexpected and built through the test of times. few of them are meant to be kept, maybe forever.